Hey everybody, Ogre here again for Ogre Breaks, doing a little box opening. I got one of the hobby boxes of Topps Gypsy Queen 2022 Baseball. Uh, one of these products is usually something that I usually like a lot. Um, I usually open up a hobby box. I'll open up usually some retail of it as well. Occasionally I might buy two hobby boxes, but uh, my local LCS, $140 uh, for the box, which I don't even know if these ever even made it to the Topps website, to my knowledge. I really didn't look. I was just more looking to get it from you know, my local LCS. Um, so I'm assuming the going rate's probably around that price, but we will get two on-card autos. There is 24 packs per box, eight cards per pack. I have seen some videos on this as well. We also did a live break on this uh, Friday night um, where we, uh, we did a break of two boxes. So I actually broke, uh, did a live break with this before I even opened up one for myself. So we had some nice pulls. We did get uh, one of the um, Jackie Robinson Day image variations. We did get uh, four autographs. One was numbered. And then with the Chrome cards that you get, you get three Chrome cards. Usually it was there was a box topper, but this year, kind of like some of the products that did last year, they just kind of mixed it in with the packs. Um, but we did pull two box toppers that were numbered to 50. So not too bad, really. So. So let's see what we get, uh, you know, looking for the Jackie Robinson Day, the City Connect uh, variations. Um, there's another variation too that I'm just drawing a blank on, it's off the top of my head, but anyway. Um, so if you haven't seen the, the cards yet, here's the front and then there is the back. It's a 300 card checklist. There is a 20 card short print checklist as well. You should get one of those per hobby box as well. So uh, we got Brett Gardner. We got Edward Cabrera, rookie card. Sony Gray. And all right, we got a black and white Javi Baez. I believe these are number to 50. Yes, they are number to 50. Uh, these are actually also a hobby exclusive. So all right, nice numbered card to start off the box. First pack, not bad at all. Number to 50. Uh, and that's also too with him in the Tigers uniform. Then we got Trey Turner, Kyle Tucker, and Leody Tavares. You know, one thing too, you gotta look for too, missing nameplates. There could also be a logo swap uh, image there as well. So a lot of things you gotta look out for if you're not familiar with Gypsy Queen. So there's also a uh, like a black removed, or I forget what it's called exactly. They're like one in, I couldn't even tell you the pack odds. The pack odds are pretty crazy on it. So I'm assuming I would probably not pull any of those. Also, too, in case anybody is curious about pack odds, here are the pack odds. You can pause the video and uh, kind of read them off yourself. I'm not going to really read them off myself. But, um, you know, the black and white is 1 in 80 packs, so not too bad. We got Albert Pools, Yasmani Grandal, Framel Reyes, Josiah Gray, rookie, Kenta Mejita. And then we have the GQ Gems, Ronald Acuna Jr. I do kind of like these mini cards. Kepler. And Braylon Marquez, so nothing too crazy there. I, I I am a little bit of a sucker for cards like this. I know a lot of people do not like these kind of cards, but I I get a little bit of a kick out of them. I enjoy them. So, but yeah, kind of like how they did the fortune tellers. I think the last two or three years at least, maybe even a little longer than that. But we got Sean Murphy, Rosarena, Aaron Ashby, rookie, Jock Peterson. Nolan Arenado, we got Contreras, Matt Burling, rookie card, and Garcia. Don't see anything crazy about those. Uh, these end in, well, they all end in 90. I, uh, I forget the number, I think it's like 10, I think. The Jackie Robinson Day variations uh, end in, I think, or something like that. I just can't remember the number off the top of my head now, but uh, we got Jackson Profar, Olds Chapman, Aguilar, McClanahan, uh, Curtis Terry, rookie, and all right, we do get a missing nameplate, Edwin Diaz, Moustakis, and Shane Boz, rookie also, so not too bad, added to my little Mets PC that I have, um, you know, just stuff randomly that I collect, or that I've pulled over the years and whatnot, so... Um, missing nameplate basically you know the name is completely missing uh which yeah those don't have a different number though so you got to really be be on the eye for those so and then Shane Baz rookie not the top ray rookie we're looking for but 
not a bad one. So, all right, next pack. We got Osmer, Winker, Garcia, Gonzalez, Betts, and all right, our first auto. Not bad, just with me being a Met fan. Mark Kana, on card, auto. Would have been nice to get maybe a rookie, um, but not bad. Definitely, uh, you know what, I'll take it though. Me being a Met fan, not too bad. So, so far, Box has been a little, you know, heavily favored for me as a Met fan. Buxton and Dane Dunning to finish off that pack. So, all right, not bad though. I'll take it. Because I think also, too, if I remember correctly, from the live break that we did with the two boxes, I believe three of the autos, if I remember correctly, were rookie cards. One was not. It was a second-year player, which actually that one was actually also numbered 299. We got Carrasco, Cedric Mullins, Brandon Marsh, rookie. Okay. Blake Snell, Rosario, and our first Chrome, ah, Aaron Nola. Okay. That one is not numbered. We got Riley, Carlson, and Pearson. So, nice chrome Aaron Nola. All right. Next pack, we got Evan Diaz. Kyle Muller. Not too bad there. Chris uh, Bryant. Jose Barrio. We have one of the die cuts. Let's see the future. Joe Adele. Chris Paddock. You Darvish. And Soroka. These uh, these die cuts, I do like the look of them. This might actually be uh, kind of like one of those sets that I'll potentially put together, maybe. We'll see. Depending on how much of this I open, how much of it I pull. We'll go from there. But I, I, I've always been kind of a sucker for die cut cards. So we got Hope Park. Looks like we got another one of those minis in this pack. Hope Park, rookie. Scooball. Garcia. Freeman. Hubert Ruiz, then we got Blake Snell, GQ Gems, Sheridan Apostol, and G-Man Choi. All right, third of the way through the box, see what we got next pack. Got Goriel Jr., Garrett Cole, Andrew Vaughn, Contreras, Rasmussen, and we do get a logo swap, Guarnier uh, Suarez, for the Reds. So um, if you look at the two cards, just to see what you can look out for if you're not familiar. Base cards have the, the three-letter abbreviation for the team. And then the logo swap will have the actual logo of the team on the bottom. And the other number is also the same on the back of the card, too. So you can't really use that. So basically, if you are going through some cards... If you've opened up any, you know, take a look out for, you know, keep an eye out for the uh, logo swap as well. We got Howard and Frias to finish off that pack. So, I mean, overall, two number cards, or I'm sorry, one number card, sorry. The logo swap and the missing nameplate. Not too bad. We got Dalton Varshow. Tyler Glass now, Jose Abreu, Keston Hira, and oh, there's our other auto though. Brian De La Cruz, okay. Kirloff, Bell, and Anderson. So here's our second auto, Brian De La Cruz, who's actually been having a pretty decent season, I believe, for the Marlins. Um, but still, nice little on card auto. So, all right, autos, definitely a little. A little underwhelming, would have liked to, but I mean, the plus side of it though, too, it wasn't two pitcher autos. Like I know a lot of products last year, if you open up any of the Chrome, a lot of people are complaining about pulling two pitcher autos. At least we got two positional players, so not too bad. We got uh, Kyle Lewis, Ian Anderson, Patrick Corbin, Donaldson, then see the future, Edward Cabrera, okay, Anderson, Albies, and Tejada. So not bad pulling another one of these. I think I think you get two of these uh, on average, if I remember correctly, and you get four of the uh, the GQ gems per hobby box on average. Uh, so I'm looking for a short print as well. Um, 
the cards numbered 301 to 320, which uh, uh, is a list of uh, all Hall of Famers or legends at very least, if they're not all Hall of Famers. Lopez, Joey Bart, Molina, Ryan Weathers, Hassan Kim, and another one of the minis, Machado. We got Blackman and Vasquez. All right, puts us right about halfway through the box. We got Tristan McKenzie, Evan White, Francisco Lindor, Brady Singer, Lars Newtbar, rookie. Then we got Guerrero Jr., De La Cruz, rookie, and Nelson Cruz. And I didn't notice anything with the cards, so I just want to make sure the numbers, yeah. So Newtbar, doesn't look like anything there. Guerrero, Cruz, Nelson Cruz, or De La Cruz and Cruz, excuse me. Um, yeah, just all base cards that time around, which will, ha will happen. All right, let's see, next pack. Got Duran Duran, okay, not bad, another decent rookie there. Perdomo, Flores, Muncie, Adamas, Soler, then Jonathan India Chrome, okay, not numbered. We got Carlos Santana and Teoscar Hernandez. India player I do like, so I'm perfectly fine to pull one of his chromes. The chromes are sharp, though. I really do like the chromes, though, with uh, this product. Like I said, we'll be, uh, we should be getting one more chrome uh, per this box. We got Luis Robert, Jackie Bradley Jr., Danzy Swanson, Colton Welker, rookie. Ben Attendi, Joe Adele, uh, Sixto Sanchez, and Gossman. And it's usually the fourth or third card to the end of the pack. Yeah, nothing there. So, and no logos or anything like that. So, just a couple of base cards. We got Josh Hader, Brantley. Dallas Keuchel, Brandon Nemo, Dylan Carlson, uh, Baez, Sam Huff, and Tommy Fan. Nothing, doesn't look like anything, but like I said, I do have to double check. I am not familiar with image, oh, actually, Carlson is a variation. Carlson is a variation, it does end in 1035 that's that's what it was i knew i thought i knew there was a 10 somewhere in there toward the end so the carlson is a variation so not too bad carlson nice little variation for sure that's why i always try to make sure i double check because honestly i would have just assumed that that was just a regular card so not too bad there Sure. So, I mean, realistically, the box has been pretty good to us. We had a number to 50 card, a missing nameplate, a logo swap, a image variation, uh, autographs, you know, could have been worse. We got Correa, Mount Castle, Luke Williams, rookie, Marcus Roman, Ryan Jeffers, and all right, here's our short print, Ty Cobb. Then we got Luis Gill and Isaac Paredes. So... Ty Cobb, our short print. Like I said, these are one per box. Uh, card number 307. Any cards numbered 301 to 320 is a short print. They are one per 24 packs. You can find them in retail as well. Um, you know, if you are opening up any of the retail, when that does hit the shelves, I would assume probably within the next week or so. Next pack. We've got Alcantara, Jacob DeGrom, Cranky, Bogarts, Logan Gilbert, Christian Javier, uh, Christian Javier, excuse me, Enrique Hernandez, and Cal Raleigh. And same thing, didn't notice anything. Looked like all just regular base cards, but yep, same thing. So, all right. Once again, appreciate you guys hanging out and watching this video. Gypsy Queen, definitely a product that I enjoy a lot. We got Lopez, rookie. We 
got Cabrian Hayes, Otani, Dahlbeck, Sanchez, uh, uh, Pez, excuse me, Otto Lopez, and Glaber. Like I said, I just want to double check. Also, to double check two rookies. Like I said, it's usually third or fourth card to the end of the pack just to play it safe. Yep, nothing there. So, and then also, too, if you're new to the channel, I'd really appreciate you subscribe, hit that notification bell. I try to open up, I try to do videos five, six times a week, plus doing some live breaks as well. Which we'll definitely be doing, you know, definitely at least some more live breaks of this product as well. We got DJ LeMayu, Dustin May, Machado, Pavon Smith. We do get some color. Hans Kraus, okay, numbered Philly rookie. Makata, Capasuano, and Alvarez. The blue, I can't remember off the top of my head, 150, they're numbered too. So, all right, another numbered card. Rookie pitcher. I know he was pit. I know he was pitching for the uh, AAA uh, Phillies uh, team, the uh, Lehigh Valley Iron Pigs. Uh, you know what? I think this one has our last chrome in it. It feels a little thicker, so let's save that one for last. Kind of cap off the, uh, the break. Still would like like to pretty much if, as long as we pull if we pull a wander, I'll be I'll be pretty much happy with this box really. So we got Pichette, Verdugo, Vado. Eloy, Stuart Fairchild, the rookie, another one of the GQ gems, Pete Alonzo, okay, very nice me being a Met fan, we got Conforto, and Williams, so happy pulling that with just being a Met fan, Alonzo has been having a pretty decent season overall, Ryu, Cronenworth, Stevenson, Mike Trout, Taylor Trammell, Yajar, and actually, no, this one does have the chrome. Jordan. So, didn't get lucky with any of the number of chromes, but that's okay. J.D. Martinez and Spencer Strider for the Braves rookie pitcher. So, didn't get lucky with any numbered chromes, but that's all right. Oh, the other pack did just feel a little thicker, but guess not. Two packs, two packs left. We got Rochella, Gavin Sheets, Upton. We're gonna get Judge, Andres Jimenez, Lewin Diaz, Corbin Burns, and Alonzo. And just double check. Didn't look like anything. Nah. I highly doubt we'll get another image variation since we did get one in the box. But never know. All right, last pack. Once again, appreciate you guys watching the video. Appreciate all the support the channel's been getting lately. You guys have been great. We got Bregman, uh, Andy, or Andrew Young, excuse me. All right, we do get an O'Neill Cruz rookie. Okay. Sale, Patino, Hans Kraus, rookie, Debbie Garcia, and Jonathan India to finish it off. So, and just to double check. Yeah, nothing there. So, all right. Overall, not a bad, I mean, it wasn't a bad box overall. I'm pretty happy with it overall. You know, there was, if, Probably if I pulled a wander, uh, just even a ba just a base, uh, probably would have made the box for me really. Um, but like I said, I can't really complain too much. Uh, the Chromes, some decent players for sure. Uh, same thing with the GQ gems, the uh, see the future cards. You know, we did get at least one rookie, which is nice as well. Uh, numbered cards, we did get Hans Kraus, that was number two one fifty. Uh, rookie pitcher for the Phillies. We did get the Javi Baez, number to 50, which is also pretty nice. Suarez, uh, logo swap. Not too bad. Carlson, one of the uh, variations. Uh, Edwin Diaz, missing nameplate. And then our two autographs, Mark Hanna, you know, for my New York Mets, which is nice. Perfectly, you know, perfectly fine taking it. And then... Brian De La Cruz, rookie uh, outfielder, which uh, he's actually been playing decent this year from what I remember seeing. And then, you know, we got to get a nice little stack of, you know, some of the rookies and stuff, but which I'll sleeve off camera. But once again, 
Greatly appreciate you guys watching the video. If you liked the video, greatly appreciate if you leave a like as well. Leave any comments on Gypsy Queen. Let me know how you feel about the product. Have you opened up any? Let me know. I'd like to hear from you guys what your pools have been. Um, and then, like I said earlier, if you're new, greatly appreciate you subscribe. Hit that notification bell for any of my future uploads. I try my best to upload five, six times a week, as well as the, you know, the occasional live breaks as well on the channel as well. If you're looking to get into any of the live breaks, follow me on Instagram, and that's how you can uh, join up on those. And uh, with that, once again, thanks, everybody, for the support on the channel. Uh, you guys have been really good, um, you know, really good to me with all the support, the subs, you know, the likes, the comments. I try to do my best to try to reply to comments uh, as best as I can. Sometimes it gets a little bit away from me just because of, you know, just day-to-day -day life. But anyway, with that, once again, appreciate you guys. Have a great one.